Hello everyone, Mr. Merkage here and today I'm going to be showing you how to do more stuff on the mood editing, uh, some more advanced stuff like making it blink and stuff like that. Um, so there's actually a software that does this called Rich Mood Editor, you might have heard of it, it's, like, it's most common out of all the mood editors about, but within the new Skype update I believe they have took, well I read online that they took some of the uh, codes out so it's some stuff's no longer possible. Um, but I'll sh I found two that really that do work, so I'll show you how to do that. Uh, in this notepad here is basically the ones that used to be. I don't know if Skype added any new ones or because I've not read the update list or whatever. But basically, it uses um, HTML tags. If you know how to code HTML, which is a pretty simple language, um, it's it's like they use that to determine what the mood's going to be. So just I is italics b is bold uh, so yeah you get the sort of the idea of how that sort of works but the ones that are only working that I've well I haven't tested them all but I read that only blink and hrefs work in I did try underline and that didn't actually show up so I think it is only blink and href working uh, I say href but I mean link in so hyperlink um, so yeah I'll show you how to do that so if we come into here um, I'm just going to copy one of these and because I made an awkward size for the tool I'm going to have to size some of this down because I don't want to change the outline of the the whole tool so I'll just shorten these down a little bit first uh, that'll do we can change the name of this to Skype Blinking Mood uh, we can just leave that as set mood so if we go, it's going to be pretty much the same as Skype mood. So if I show you what we did here, we we use Skype dot current user profile dot mood text equals the text box. Um, but instead of using mood text, we're going to be using rich mood text. Um, so that will allow us to use the tags and stuff. So if we double click on uh, this button, and we can just type uh, Skype dot oops. Skype dot current user profile dot rich mood text and that's going to be equal to um we're gonna have to do a little bit of a like a little bit of a trick here because we need the tags as well as the input. So in the speech marks here we want to use the tag and the HTML tag for blink in is blink. So in the first one here we're gonna need blink. Uh so we need to add on the text box and close it's important that when you're coding HTML you close the tag because if you don't close it it's nothing's going to work so how you close it is using a forward slash and blink so now anything wrapped in the blink tags will blink so inside the plus we're just going to want to add text box I think it's 14 yeah text box 14 dot text and that should pretty much be it when this error decides to go yeah so whatever we enter well pretty much whatever we enter into this text box here is going to be wrapped in the blink tags so it will blink so let's test this out uh, quickly open up Skype oh, as you can see I've already got it here I'll, I'll remove that Uh, so we can't open the tool and connect quickly. So once we're connected, uh, go over to profile and inside the blinking mood, uh, I'm going to type something in. As you can see, I've got no mood at the minute. So when I press set mood, it has changed it to uh, testing, blinking. So that's that working. Um, I'll show you how to do another. Uh, so if we close this down. Um, copy one of these and bring it down uh, so if we double click this button um, we do skype dot current user profile dot rich mood text and equal to uh, like I said I don't think some of these work but I'm, I'm going to try it anyway just so I know that they don't work so um, for this I'll use center uh, so 
in here would be central west bar dash center plays a tag and that should be text box 15 15 dot text uh, so let's try this out quickly I just want to know for myself that it's really not working so connect to Skype profile Yeah, so as you can see, it changed it to test, but it's not centered. Um, I don't know if it shows it centered here. If I, set, for example, if you go to someone's profile, it might be centered here, but I'm not too sure. I don't think that's working anymore. So yeah, that probably is true that they're not they're not working. Uh, so I'm just going to remove this one. If I remove that and remove the code and I'll leave it as that so I'm sorry this was short but I'm sort of running out of things what to do so if you've got any ideas if you could post them below and I'll try to do my best I'll do my best to try and do that um, but yeah like I say the only ones I think that are working is blinking and using hyperlinks so you could try to do this one yourself uh, it'll pretty much be the same as the blinking one uh, so yeah that's it for this video I hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you next time